those of you that have been with me on a show, I should say with us on a show, right? Now that one of my favorite, one of our favorite categories is the Franklin Half Dollar Series. And there's the uncirculated, which are always fun. And then we have some serious fun when we get to talk about the proofs. Well, tonight we're going to take it to a different level. We're going to talk about the finest known from the last three years. Those last three years, right there, 1961, 1962, and 1963. That is the end of the era for the Franklin Half Dollar Series. Now, these are the proofs, everybody. They were only made available in those proof sets issued those years. And if you're familiar with the proof set packaging of those years, there was a poly pack. The coin kind of was sitting inside a little air bubble of plastic in an envelope. And based on how they were stored or moved around or shipped, they moved around inside that packaging. And uh, that is why. Uh, when we get into talking about the grading, which is what you'll see, these are proof 69s graded by NGC. Yeah, the numbers of how many have made that grade of 69 are so small, and it's basically because of how they were packaged. I did say it's the finest known because there is not one single 70 on any of the Franklin half dollars ever certified by NGC, nor PCGS for that matter. And again, because of that poly pack you referenced. So the finest known strike is a 69. The numbers behind it, though, are what I really hone in on. It's why I look at the price per coin, the value, and just say, how can this be? It's not logical when you compare it to Silver Eagles or even the modern Kennedy sets the government's put out in the last 20 years. So we have proof sets, right? Three million proof sets were made in 1961, and NGC has certified 47,000 Franklins. 1962, 3.2 million proof sets, silver proof sets. 52,000 coins have been certified. And then in 1963, the last year of issue in the Franklin series, they made a little over 3 million proof sets again, and 58,000 coins have been certified. So you're looking at these three dates, 61, 62, and 1963. Steve just told you, I'm going to repeat it just to kind of give you that information so it's fresh. 47,000 coins of 1961, 52,000 of 1962, and 58,000 in 1963. However, in this grade, which is the finest, it's a 69, for 1961, the population, which is the total number of 1961s in 69, 1,042. That is a shocking, shockingly small amount. And the 1962 and 1963 are just as impressive. 1,067 coins are in 1962 of grade 69. And for 1963, just 2,325 uh, are, are known to exist in grade 69. So if the U.S. Mint today made a coin with only 1,000 known, what's going to happen? If they made it with only 2,000 coins, What's going to happen? Well, if you look at the Silver Eagle pockets, which we've seen for the last 39 years, the world loves our Silver Eagle, and you go to the three rarest coins. The first is going to be the 2019S Enhanced Reverse Proof. And since these are modern issues and the techniques of striking are better, packaging is better, of the finest known as a 70 in these coins. Right? We have that coin. There are almost 10,000 of them known to exist in 70, and it's a $4,500 coin. When you go to number three, number three, you go to the 2020 V75, 75,000 coins made. Beautiful. Victory celebrating 75th anniversary of World War II. And today in 70, 16,000 coins, and it's a $1,500 coin. You know what the number one is? The number one is the 95W. It was part of that 10th anniversary gold set, right? 32,500 coins were made. And there's about 1,000 of them known in 70. That's a $20,000 coin. Let me repeat these three again. 1,042, 1,067, 2325. And they are 75 years older. And we're at $299.95 of your choice tonight, one of our great deals of this evening. 
There you go, everybody. I mean, these coins are very special. Our competition thinks they are as well because they are their prices for these same three dates, $522, $549.98 and $522.49 respectively for these exact three dates into that exact grade. It's graded by NGC. So apples to apples, we're beating them by hundreds of dollars each. Steve just referenced, it is a your choice. Each one of these has its own item number. You see it there on the left in red. So mention uh, one of those or all three of them, whatever you'd like. Uh, you don't have to buy all three to get the low price, but you're welcome to, to get the, you know, the finest known grade of each one of these dates, the last three years of issue for the Franklin Proofs. Uh, to our operators when you call, or if you're joining us via the web, head over to abccoins.com, enter one of those item numbers one by one into the search bar, add it to your cart. Uh, the last thing I want to mention is each one has its own QR code. So all you have to do is focus your camera on your phone to one of those QR codes or one at a time. It'll pop up the website. Easy to order. Just hit add to cart and carry on, right? Come back to the show. You're saving hundreds of dollars. Again, they're over $500 on each one of these, and we're under 300 on Again, each one of these. This is not a Walmart versus Target competition on a gallon of milk where Target's make it up, 1995, and Walmart's going to be at 1988. Saving money, saving money. I get it. They're at 500. We're under 300. It's not a close competition, and it's the same exact coins. Our relationships with the people that have the best eyes in the industry get us the coins. And it gives us the ability to bring them to you at crazy prices. It's just special. Let's take a few seconds to talk about proofs, a few questions. They made the Franklin Half Dollar series from 1948 through 1963. Those 16 years, the Kennedy replaced it in 64. All right? The proof set, proof as a product or a method of manufacture, started in 1950 for the collecting public. So there are only 14 proof Franklins, 16 Franklin years. Proof, again, a method of manufacture, polishing the dies, polishing the piece of metal, the silver here, striking it twice with enormous pressure. You can see yourself like it's a mirror. It is outstanding. The other small comment is these are all Philadelphia proofs. San Francisco took over in 1968. Folks, we do have to put a 30-second clock up at this point. These are those 90% proofs taken from the proof sets. They didn't make them or in any other way except the proof set. Because of the packaging, they slid around, and they just really don't have a lot of high grades out there. This is the highest grade known. There are nothing better. This is the finest known for each one of these dates. There's only 1,042 on the 61, 1,067 on the 1962, and just 2,325 on the 1963. That is why they're special. They are very, very rare. And the price tonight, $299.95 is hundreds of dollars off our nearest competition. Love the conversation on, hey, what's your best coin? Well, I have one of those S Enhanced Reverse Proofs in 70, which is a beautiful coin. And they're, give or take, $4,000 to $4,500, right? 10,000 of those known. My best coin, it's a 61 Franklin and 69, the finest known. There's only 1,042 of those. What do you think I paid for it? I paid $299.95 because <laughs> I know the people at ABC. Thanks That's for listening. That's the way to go.